So lower cross syndrome can cause things like sciatica, low back pain, and reduced range of motion. Um, it's important to have good flexibility for good range of motion and um, good movement. Two things that cause limited flexibility are your hip flexors. Sometimes they pull forward on your low back and your glutes as well being weak um, can also cause you to shift and just have um, limited flexibility and range of motion. So I'm going to be showing you two stretches that you can use to um, stretch out your hips and lower body. So there are two good stretches that you can do at work or at home. Um, the first one is for your glutes. You're going to take a seat on a chair or a bench. You're going to place your foot on the opposite knee like this. And sometimes this can be more than enough stretch for you, but if you need to, you can go down towards your leg or you can pull up the knee towards your chest. But you're going to feel it in that side, that hip glute area. You're going to hold it for 30 seconds and then we'll do it on both sides. Another good stretch that you can do is for your hip flexors. So you're gonna find a chair or a bench, you're gonna place one knee down, and then you're gonna bring your other foot forward, and you're gonna drive this knee forward to get a good stretch on the opposite hip flexor. Hold this stretch for 30 seconds, and then switch and do it on the opposite side. I hope these stretches helped you out. Um, if you know anybody who's suffering from lower cost syndrome or sciatica, uh, go ahead and like, share uh, this video.